Next level feet. Bitch, my back feels like it's gonna snap in half. All right, come on, pose, okay. pose. Ah, good day everyone, and welcome to today's video where I'm going to be recreating my boyfriend's Instagram photos. So you guys have really liked the past ones that I have done of recreating YouTubers, recreating the Kardashians, but now I'm taking it home to recreating my boyfriends. I'm actually very excited about this because my boyfriend has a wonderful Instagram page that I am very inspired by and he is just the most handsome man in the world. So I wanted to, I guess, steal some of his ideas. Uh, so I picked out like some of my favorite photos of him. So yeah, I guess let's get started, shall we? Oh, we shall. So the first one that I'm going to recreate is this one right here, which, oh my God, he is just, something. So uh, he has all this face paint on, which I think looks really freaking cool. Uh, so I'm going to try my best to recreate that look on my face. Probably gonna be really difficult, but we are going to try and I'm gonna try to be that uh, sexy, but I'm not sure I can, but let's try. Alrighty, so I have some face paints to try and mimic. Oh, that's a flower for the other picture. But yeah, I have these to try and recreate this look. So here's a time lapse of me transforming my face. Okay, this was extremely difficult to remake. I feel like I was making progress with the nose, but it's so hard to get in the details of these with um, the colors just because the face paint isn't really that good and it's not precise enough. But here I was able to smudge in the pigment, but over here it's just like, oh, what happened to us? But again, that's what face stands for. <laughs> it's all a trick. All right, let's take this photo. <sighs> okay, so I didn't do both sides because I knew that it's just half the face in the photo. You so cheated the system. I cheated. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Am I you? Are mm -hmm. you jealous? No. <laughs> no. It's gonna have to be heavily tuned, but you know what? We got something. Okay, so we are back and here they are side by side. I definitely think the artwork on his face looks a lot better. And obviously this was taken on a professional camera versus my iPhone picture, but I feel like I got the essence of what the photo was supposed to be. But yeah, I, I think it's a cool photo regardless. So I like it. What do you guys think? Oh, and also this photo of him is my background of my phone. So um, I really like that photo. Okay, up next is a real simple one. This one, he looks like Draco Malfoy in because he has the blonde hair and like a Slytherin type jacket. I do not have that green jacket because it's currently in storage, but I do have like a Gryffindor version because it's maroon. So I'm going to try and attempt to recreate this. I feel like it'll be a lot easier because we both have the blonde hair and it's just laying on grass. So let's get to it. Basically, I just need to lay on the grass and take a selfie. Is that all you did, Danny? Yes, just think that you're on Riverdale. Oh. Riverdale vibes. Suck your cheeks in. Not that much. <laughs> Pucker a little bit, but you don't have much to work with. <laughs> Hi, yeah. All right, I think we got it. I can get out of the stinky stink of grass. <laughs> All right, so here they are side by side. Uh, this is like the Gryffindor version of his Slytherin. Um, but here's also a Photoshop version where I have the green ones. So it looks a little bit more similar, but this one was definitely a lot easier to recreate. And uh, yeah, I think it turned out great. Okay, up next is this photo right here that we actually took at a hot spring uh, in Mammoth. So obviously in LA, we don't live near any hot springs. So I'm gonna have to get creative. So uh, let's go try and recreate this like a milky water look. Okay, so I filled the bathtub up with some clear water. Um, it has kind of like a blue vibe to it already, but it needs to be milky. So I'm gonna put some almond milk in and see if this makes it look like the milky hot spring. Ew. Alrighty. I think it looks about right. Okay. Okay, so you need a wet? Oh, wait, where are the pictures? In there? I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> Lift your head up more. Can you tell that I'm in a bathtub right now? No. <gasps> Fun. Well, I think we got it. 
We're good. He had better lighting because it was natural lighting, but here they are side by side. I did the best I could to try and recreate this. Um, again, the lighting was obviously a lot different and I was in a bathtub versus in an actual hot spring. So this is the best you're gonna get with an iPhone quality camera and um, in my bathtub. So next is this photo right here that our friend Hope created for him. I think she also did the face paint for him, but uh, she put this really cool ombre flower look on his eyes. Uh, she's done it to me before as well, but I obviously want to recreate this because it's a really cool look. So basically I'm just going to have to glue a lot of flower petals to my face, which sounds fun. So let's do it. Okay, so I got some fake flowers that I'm going to glue, hot glue to my face. <laughs> just kidding. I got Elmer's. Um, uh, oh, <laughs> excuse me. Yeah, basically I'm just going to like glue them onto my face in a cute way. So let's let the process commence. Okay, so this is the best that I could accomplish. Uh, it, it looks fine if you don't look close enough. Uh, but Danny boy accidentally had the pool running a little too long, so it's literally about to overflow. But it actually kind of works because in his photo, it's like he's laying on a uh, water so it's kind of I don't know if I want to actually lay in this because it's probably real cold but you know what let's just do it I gotta lay down on this cold floor back it up oh that's cold oh I don't like it back it up I don't like it I fight back up anymore I'm gonna drown in this pool no you have to put your waist on the brick what you need to get the picture <sighs> I'll put your arms over you. Oh, okay. Come Give on. me a moment. <laughs> okay, you look crazy, so get it together. Next level feet. Bitch, my back feels like it's gonna snap in half. All right, come on, pose, okay. pose. <laughs> no, no. Okay, okay. <laughs> you fucker. Okay. <laughs> I've fallen and I can't get up. All right, well, here they are side by side. Chanel versus Walmart, clearly. Um, it was hard to get it to look that cute. Um, I mean, it's still a cool shot, but I mean, it was the best I could do. I'm no wigs work. And last but not least is this photo right here, which was actually the very first photo that I saw of Daniel and what hooked me in immediately. Uh, I just thought he was the most beautiful boy I'd ever seen. And I was just like, wow, he's so cool. He likes vintage cars, even though I know nothing about cars, but I don't know, it was just very attractive to me. Uh, so we're gonna go head out and try and find a car similar to that is gonna be real difficult, but uh, it's LA. I feel like we can find something. So we're in the car, we're browsing around trying to find ourselves an old vintage red car. I have a feeling this is going to be quite difficult, but we might we might be lucky. That could work if we like if I Photoshop it red. Right, it kind of has the vibe. I think the owner's on the porch. Okay. So <laughs> There's a Volvo over here. It looks old. Does that look? That's awful. <laughs> okay, we we'll keep looking. God, I think we found it. Even though it's not red, it's vintage and it looks really cool. So we're just gonna park right over here. You're a fraud. It's fine. That's what Photoshop and Facetune's for. All right, so you need to sit down right in front of the license plate. Yep. Yeah, okay, cheekbones for years. That's so weird. We literally look the same. Are you my brother? People ask us that all the time. We're brothers and we're lovers. Uh, yeah. All right, so here they are side by side. Uh, obviously, I could not find that same car, so this one's gonna have to do. Uh, but yeah, I, I still think Daniel looks way more cute than I do. But you know what? We made it work and I recreated it as best I could. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up and let me know down in the comments who you want to see me try and recreate their 
whatever. Um, and I will check out those comments and hit that bell notification button. It will tell you every time I post a new video because the subscribe button sucks. And also a huge thank you to my boyfriend Daniel for the inspiration of this video. You guys should definitely go check out his Instagram and follow him. I will link him down below. Uh, he posts really amazing photos and I love him. So you guys should go and follow him. Uh, he's so close to hitting a million. So it would mean a lot to him if you went and checked out his stuff. So yeah, that's it for today. I love you. I will see you all tomorrow. Food damn.